A record number of new COVID infections, nearly 130,000 across the UK. But as the booster rollout continues, there are early signs Omicron is leading to fewer hospitalizations. We do watch very carefully all of the data. Um, and we have had some, some good news that it does seem to be a bit milder in terms of severity. Meanwhile, France records one of the highest daily infection rates in the world since the start of the pandemic, 180,000 cases. Also tonight, how poverty is forcing children in Afghanistan out of school and into work. As quickly as possible. Oh, there we go. And questions and recriminations after England lose the Ashes to Australia in a crushing defeat. Good evening. The government says it will keep under very close review its decision not to bring in further coronavirus restrictions in England as infections rise to a level not seen before in the pandemic. There are restrictions on socialising in the rest of the UK. The early indications are that the Omicron variant is not leading to the same level of... There's more throughout the evening on the BBC News Channel. Now on BBC One, it's time for the news where you are. Bye-bye. Hello, good evening. It's been described by the hospitality sector as a lifeline for pubs, bars and clubs relying on New Year trade for their survival. But while the dis... Keep you posted. Stay safe. See you soon. That's it from me, Anna Wine, for now. I'm back, though, with you at 10.25. So join me then. Goodbye.